Hello friends, welcome to another Darktable tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to use high pass and low pass module in Darktable. If you don't know, high pass filter is used for sharpening the image and low pass filter is used for smoothening the image. We also use high pass filter for removing the noise from the image and low pass filter helps in removal of lysing effect in the image. My name is Mudassir Hussain and welcome to my channel Living Image. If you are new to this channel, please consider subscribing. I publish weekly tutorials on photography, editing and tech. Anyways, without further ado, let's get started. Friends, as you can see, I've got two images here. First one is untouched. I mean, before applying high pass and low pass filters. And the second one after applying the filters. So we are going to bring more or less the same look in the first image as it is in the second one. So first we go to the menu to find high pass and low pass module. If you do not see them, you can simply search here. So first we activate the high pass module and then we'll be applying the um, low pass module. As soon as we activate this module, the sharpness and contrast gets highlighted with black and white. We can adjust the values of sharpness and contrast according to our preferences, but personally I recommend to keep the values below 20% most of the time. Since this image looks quite okay, I am going to keep the sharpness and contrast value below 15%. And then we go to uniformly menu and then change the blend mode to soft light. But you can go with the other mode as well, um, such as overlay. You also can adjust the opacity if you want, but mostly I keep it as it is. As you can see, the eyes do not look as sharp as other part of the image. So we are going to add some extra sharpness using mask in the eyes. To do that, we duplicate the instance. And then we go to drone and parametric mask. We take the ellipse mask and place it over the eyes. Now we change the mode to overlay. Friends, as you can see, the eyes have been sharpened. Now we are going to use low pass module. First, we activate the module. The image gets blurred as soon as we activate the low pass module. Here we can adjust the radius, saturation, contrast and brightness values according to our preferences. When you are happy with the settings, go to uniformly menu again. From there, change the blend mode to soft light. You can adjust all the settings after changing the blend mode to Just to show you, I'm using the mask again. So first I'm duplicating the instance. Friends, as you can see, the left eye of the model hasn't got enough light compared to right eye. So we are going to fix that. We are going to increase the light of the left eye by using mask again. Go to drone and parametric mask. From there, similarly, take ellipse and place it over the left eye. Now we adjust the brightness value.
change the blend mode according to your preferences. Friends, now let's check the changes after applying high pass and low pass. Okay, here is one thing I want to mention. You do not need to use both of these modules together unless there is a specific need for them. I have used them together just to show you the process. Anyways friends, this is how you can simply use high pass and low pass module in Darktable. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.